tweeze my brows with these every time I tweeze my brows for the year. And these scissors, I'm not kidding, have been in my personal makeup bag for a year. So it's great to finally have these tools be birthed into the universe. You can pick up these tools this Friday at TrixieCosmetics.com. Upgrade your life through fabulous tools. Goodbye. Cool? Yeah. Woo! Kicking ass. Get the hell out of my way, Byron. <laughs> We're going to Amoeba. All right. By the way, what is this life? Look, we have a green juice and a bowl of cherries. Um, yes, I'm doing a quick change. I'm gonna keep this hair on and um, let's go get the outfit, shall we? Let's do it. So we now have so many costumes that a costume rack lives in the middle of the living room. So <laughs> I'm gonna wear this because I just feel like it. I thought, you know, blonde and pink album, why not wear purple? Do we have go-go, can I have those go-go boots, Brandon? Brandon and I just got back from tour and we're still recovering. You guys came on a good day because I spent days, days decluttering this makeup and uh, then Brandon came in here and cleaned today. So don't get it twisted. This looked like absolute shit yesterday. <laughs> Honestly, I know this is chaotic, but this is like the cleanest it's been in months. So do you think I'll get demonetized for being drag naked in here? I don't know. Do you want to risk it? I don't care what happens. Oh, oh, <laughs> my breasts. Everybody saw my breasts. How often do you guys get embarrassed of working for me? <laughs> this is fun. Look, I have all my Trixie Cosmetics products on the walls. If you ever see me using my desk and you're like, why doesn't she ever have products in the desk? Because they're on display. You don't take pieces of art and shut them away in a drawer. You put them on display. <laughs> I go That's perfect. Uh, insane. Oh, 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 oh. They just, they're so heavy, they don't want to stay on the shelves. Like, how do people do this? I guess they don't do this. When Dragon Boy's like, how do people do this? But no one does this. <laughs> Brandon, can we bring some nail stickers just in case one of these falls off? Chaos. I know you, real celebrities have teams of people helping them. You just have three people filming you while you struggle. I know. Well, you're not supposed to interfere with the subject, right? Like, if you're doing National Geographic and the mother chimpanzee is beating the sh out of the sun, I've been watching a lot of TikTok about monkeys, and there's a lot of mean monkey parents. Like monkey, like the mother monkeys are not nice to the kids always. Redo my hands. Oh. I don't really don't wear this type of color, but this gimmick place, gimmicks makes like 60s dresses, and they sent me this, and I waited to wear it, and then I, then I tried it on, and I was like, oh, I love this dress. It's also nice, because normally to me, I have to do a performance, but this time, I guess they heard the record and said, never mind. So that's good. They saw me on Jimmy Kimmel and they're like, we're good. It's my accountant. Hello. I'm about to go there now. You should see the line around the block to get their album signed by Trixie Mattel. Oh my God. Maybe they saw the poster and they thought it was Jennifer Coolidge. I'm standing here on Hollywood Boulevard and it goes the whole way down to Sunset. People must be lost. They must think they're at Supreme. <laughs> they think they're waiting for sneakers. It's back to the fuchsia purse. Do you ever get nervous with large crowds like that? Like knowing that they're waiting for you, excited to see you, or is it fun? I don't really get nervous because they're there because they like me. I mean, it was a lot harder when I had to perform for people I don't know every single night for like, you know, seven, eight years. Then you have to win over people who have no reason to like you. But it's a lot more fun to present something to people who come in wanting to enjoy what you do. We have touch-up items, Brandon. Let's go. I bet you the people who live here cannot wait for me to move. They were complaining about you, Nick. They were like, is that little blonde gonna keep coming here? Nick and I had that kind of relationship. Right, Nick? We have that kind of relationship where we roast each other. That's my job, I'm paid for it. Yeah, he roasts me in front of millions and I just call him horrible things privately. I think he has the better deal here. It's right from the air back, air back. Okay, we'll wait for you. Well, this is what it takes. Well, I recently saw a video of Sharon Stone and she was getting ready for a red carpet and she was surrounded by like hair and makeup people and costume people and they're all fussing over her. And she goes, <laughs> this is what it takes. And I just feel that all the time, but instead of a team, it's me. I'll tell you this. It's nice to have a very loyal um, group of people who listen to the records and stuff because whenever there's like something like this, they always show up. 
And so, like, I never have to be like, oh, my God, are people going to come? Where? Sorry about my friends. A few nights ago in Australia, I performed Hello, Hello with the dancers. And I finished the song. And after people were clapping, somebody screamed, Trixie, we love you, but we hate your music. And then I just had to keep going. So people are really cool. I was like, well, I guess you're going to have to call Billboard and ask him to remove it from three different charts. Good luck. Hello, Ori. Hello, Ori. Hey, I hope you're having a lovely time. It's going to be great. We're going to get in there. I don't know how many people it is. Luckily, when I've done signings at Amoeba, I think this is my third one. We live really close to Amoeba, so it's not like, you know, it's kind of nice. Sometimes I get booked at studios that are like walking distance from my house, and it's really nice. One time I did a prep commercial that shot on the same block as me and I walked there. Yeah. In drag. Uh-huh. We filmed a prep commercial in a gym. It was like an 80s gym. And we just went to a gym, a real gym, and filmed it. I've done nine prep commercials. I guess when people see me, they just think somebody who needs HIV protection. You know, like, it's all fun and games except it's FDA. Like, you have to say that medical copy exactly correct. I was saying it in my sleep. PrEP is a prescription medication that can help reduce your risk of getting HIV through sex when taken every day and used with other safer sex practices. But what about pregnancy and other STIs? PrEP doesn't protect against pregnancy or other STIs, but it does reduce your risk of getting HIV 1 through sex by 90%. And that's on period. That wasn't part of it. I added that. I never have to memorize lines anymore, though, so whenever I do, it takes... Uh, a hundred percent of my. Whatever I do, I don't. <laughs> yeah, <she doesn't. laughs> Trixie and Katya live. I had to memorize the whole thing. And even then, you say it different every night. I don't know why I'm getting roasted. I thought it was. People who have like Trixie as their profile picture, who like come to everything. If I tweet like "Good morning," they're like, "Shut up." <laughs> so I don't know. That's true. It is true. They're like, "You old fat bald bitch." I'm like, "Okay, work." This might be the reveal of Brandon's haircut on this channel. Ooh. Well, he wanted to donate it, but apparently you can't have lice. Oh, are these fans? No, there's people waiting to cross the street. <laughs> I'm like, please leave me alone. I'm a person. They're like, we're just crossing the street. Like, how are you? The Trixie Discovery billboard is up here. It's right there. Do you see it? Oh my God, there's so many people. That's crazy. Thank you. Oh, God. Oh. 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 I can't. Wow! Wow! She has arrived! Wow. Hi! Hi! Can I get in that little touch-up bag quick before yeah. we go out there? Do you know how many people are here? Is there a limited? It's up to 200. As long as somebody, they cut them off in line so they don't wait for nothing, right? Yes. Okay, cool. Um, before we go out, I need you to They're all waiting for nothing. Shut up, Brandon. <laughs> it's just your signature. Okay. Yeah. That's on you? Oh. Pretty. Have a oh, there's no alcohol. What? <laughs> well, there's no alcohol, so I guess we're gonna have to drink the Purell. Go sit in front of the Amoeba music sign. I hope that's cute. We have no way of knowing. Oh, this is sickening. Oh my god. <laughs> it was there. <laughs> I wish, this is so cool. Although I don't even know how to watch a VHS anymore. Three. I'm ready if they are. Are they waiting for something? Yeah, oh, you're waiting right. for me? Oh, sorry. Yeah, Thank you for coming, Alex. Well, if you're first in line, you must have been out there a while. Hello. You look so beautiful. It's amazing. Those are so cute.
I don't ever get enough time with you. We, I know, well, you always come on the busy days, which is every day, so. <laughs> I'll catch you on a non-busy day and we'll smooth. Well, ask Brandon how fun it is to spend time with me all the time. <laughs> it's horrible. Thank you for everything. Oh, you're always really so welcome. It. So cute. Wow. So, how old? Seven weeks. So cute. Oh, my God. I'll trade you my boyfriend for this dog. I don't know. No, Sounds okay. like more work. It is more work. Thank you. <laughs> Something uh, fierce but cringe happened the other day. I was in the Uber, in the Uber, I was uh, out of drag, and they said, uh, I said, oh, I'm going over here because I work right here. And he goes, oh, what do you do? And we were driving by the billboard the same second, and I just went for it, and I said, that. But also, the uh. billboard's in drag, and so he's probably like, what, you hang billboards? Like, <laughs> what do you do? You well, that was fun. Not a lot of touching, which was great. I think the monkeypox COVID energy is in the air, which means no touching, which is good. A lot of nice people, people, some, the, the first like 30 people all said they were in line since like nine in the morning. Oh my God. The meet and greet wasn't until five. And I, I appreciate the sentiment, but girl, you could have probably showed up at three and no one was in line. I appreciate the, the bold moves, but it's not Julia Roberts, you know? It's, Ju it's not even Julia Child. Not it's, not, it's not any woman, of the Julias. Mama, uh, it's not Pretty Woman. It's pretty much a man. <laughs> you know yeah, what I mean? Totally. But everybody was really nice. And there were some criers, but they had a good time. But people do that on the tours, too. They, they, they have, on the tours, they have an assigned seat. And they get there at 10 in the morning for, like, no reason. Some people just like that. Normally, David Silver comes and he buys, like, VHSs of movies from the 90s no one cares about. Last time he was here, though, he bought the... DVD and CD of the Josie and the Pussycats movie, so the taste. It's my it look like sure was. Yeah. Uh. Okay, great. Oh god. So now we're gonna get a drag. I mean, you can see all the Sharpie markers from signing stuff. And I recently organized my jewelry, so everything has a place. Well, I need that to be done too. Like <laughs> but look how many like look how many earrings. Like. Oh, you like these? Great, we have them in blue. You know what I mean? Like everything has doubles and triples. These boots hurt. It's almost like they were $40 or something. <laughs> I try to save my bobby pins. These bobby pins are geisha bobby pins and they are not easy to come by. So sometimes if you run out, they're hard to restock. So I try to save them. Geisha pins are really big black pins. So they're good for wigs. Oh. Like I said, this is clean in here, sadly. Okay, get out of here. I'm getting out of drag. Come on, get out of here. You've seen enough. Come on, I'm not. A, I'm a person. Thank you. <sighs> I'm exhausted. Thank you for coming, but it's time for bed. So you gotta go. Goodbye. Goodbye. Come on. Go. Go. That all way. All right. All right. Peace. Thank you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> bye. Bye. Bye.